It seemed like you had a lot of luck today. You had one puck, you made a save, it goes in off your defenseman. The game-winning goal goes in off, uh, it's tipped in front of the net. It just didn't seem like you had a lot of puck luck tonight. No, and that's sometimes the way it, got, it goes. Um, that's the game we got to try and win 2-1, and I take responsibility for that. It's my job to get wins, and unfortunately, I didn't get it tonight. The, uh, it seemed like you did have the energy. Uh, sometimes when you have a long flight like that, uh, the team doesn't have energy. But in the first period, you got through the penalty kill real well. And did, did it appear to you that it was good energy for the team? The guys played great tonight. I thought, I thought they had ton of energy throughout the whole game. They came out. Um, it's always tough to get going after two PKs, but I think we did an awesome job killing them off. And then uh, and the guys played awesome tonight. You could see they played hard, really, really hard all game long. And unfortunately, it's, it's a game we got to win. And unfortunately, we don't win the win. But I mean, the guys played extremely hard tonight. Derek, is the, the frustration on the winning goal, I mean, you made a 10 bell save like five seconds before. Yeah, that's, that's hockey sometimes. Sometimes you don't get those bounces. Sometimes those things happen. And unfortunately, I still got to, I mean, we got to try and win that game. That's a big game for us to win. And, and uh, we don't pull it off. So, yeah, we'll go, we'll look at that one and I'll look at it with Bales and get better from there. A little disconcerting to come home from a good trip and have half the crowd rooting for the other team. No, um, I didn't notice that. I thought the, our crowd was good. I thought our crowd was really good. I mean, our crowd's been loud the whole season for us. And um, I, I, I didn't notice that, so I, I thought they were pretty loud for us, and uh, that's the way it is. How do you get yourself ready for a game when you, you play in Seattle, the next day you have a long flight home, you don't get to get a, a workout or anything in, and then you got a game on Thursday. How do you take care of yourself to get yourself ready for that challenge? Uh, just, I mean, just do the little things I can. I mean, last night I tried to get to bed really early, just tried to go through my same routine I go through every single night, and then we got to the rink in the morning, and I thought the coaches put us through a great pregame skate. As you can tell, we were ready to play tonight, and they got us ready to play, and they got us ready to go tonight. They were great for us. They uh, understood what we needed, and the coach did a great job of uh, getting our legs ready to go, and we, we were flying tonight. I thought we had a good game. How's the adjustment to the workload going so far? Obviously, we knew you'd be taking under a lot more games. How's it feeling a handful through? It feels good so far. I mean, I don't feel tired at all, so that's, that's okay. a positive sign. Um, no, I feel really good. Uh, I'm just, I'm just taking it day by day and still trying to get better every single time I step on the ice. And for myself, it's just continuing to build every day.